Today we're going to make an Indian lamb curry. Super easy to make, 30 minutes of prep time, about two hours of braising time in the oven. You can serve it over a bed of rice with some naan bread on the side and a cool cucumber salad for a nice hot day like today. Okay, so the first thing we want to do is take about five cloves of garlic, about a really big thumb size piece of, uh, of ginger, and two to three medium yellow onions, and we're going to uh, take the skin off of all of them, and then we're gonna puree them in a food processor. And there's our lovely puree. Now we're gonna set that aside. Okay, I've got some very hot vegetable oil inside my saute pan, and to that I'm gonna add my spices, which consist of ground cumin, uh, turmeric, uh, a little bit of ground coriander, uh, I've got some curry powder, some ginger powder, uh, and just various types of um, Indian uh, spices. And I'm gonna add the, them to the oil and fry them in the oil. Oh, and of course there's cinnamon in there as well. Now we'll add our lamb shoulder to the pot. And saute it for about three to five minutes. Okay, now we're going to add the onion puree into this mixture and we're going to cook it together for about another five to seven minutes. Mix it well. Okay and finally we're going to stir in a 28 ounce can of diced tomatoes. Okay, so this is just about ready to go in the oven at 300 degrees Fahrenheit, but before we do that, we're gonna season and salt it to taste. So I'm putting in some kosher salt just to uh, give it the right uh, seasoning. Okay, now we put our uh, pot inside the oven for uh, about two hours, two to three hours to uh, slowly uh, braise at 300 degrees Fahrenheit. We'll check on it on an hourly basis. Okay, so here we are after one hour of cooking. And looks good, but it's still got a ways to go. We can mix the sauce up a little bit. It's definitely getting a lot more tender. We'll give it a taste and put it back in for another hour or so. Okay, so here we are at two hours of cooking and you wanna just skim the oil off the top and uh, put it away someplace to make this just a little bit leaner and you just don't need all that oil. That oil is coming out of the lamb meat at this point. Okay, so this has now been in there for two hours and you want to go ahead and remove the bay leaves and the cinnamon sticks that were in there. And now we're gonna add a little bit of uh, sour cream. So in goes our first heaping tablespoon of sour cream and we'll put in one more and stir these in. And uh, and that's it. I'm gonna serve it over a bed of rice.